Today, we're going to talk about a piece of gear that most taller riders will find very difficult to source, and that's riding boots. So I had mentioned that uh, uh, riding boots are difficult to find in the Indian market and that's not uh, actually true. If your shoe size is US 11 or below, there's a wide variety of uh, shoes that are available as this is the common shoe size that is imported from outside. So all the way from 11 to 7 in terms of uh, shoe size, it's available. But for taller riders who have larger uh, feet, uh, we do find a bit of a difficulty in sourcing shoes of any size, uh, any type for that matter, uh, be it uh, size 12 and above. It's just difficult and this is where the, this video creates value because I found a place where you can purchase shoes online. It's Lazy As Bikers, uh, which is a biking apparel store in Mumbai that uh, stores sizes all the way up to say size 48 uh, that is uh, the European sizing uh, uh, element or standard and uh, I was able to go there thankfully before the 2021 lockdown started and pick out uh, two shoes for myself uh, one is uh, Exustar. Now on Exustar, they had uh, some crazy level of discount because uh, this was the really old stock that they had. Uh, and it's kind of understandable. The larger shoe sizes in India don't move as easily as some of the smaller shoe sizes. So I got this on a very hefty discount from uh, Daisy as Bikers. And then on the retail side, I wanted to buy a really good pair of uh, touring and adventure boots and that's why I picked out Garni uh, or however that's pronounced Gearni or whatever um, and I was able to find two shoes that fit me. So let's uh, give you a quick uh, sneak peek into the shoes that I have purchased. A few moments later. So these are the two shoes that I have purchased. These ones are my regular use shoes. Now these are the Exustar shoes, as you can see there is a bit of wear and tear in the shoe, uh, in the lining and the other elements that are there, but it's a very comfortable shoe for your regular use, it's fairly simple wearing mechanism, there's a zip that comes down all the way and a bit of velcro to secure the flap and to cover the zip and uh, it does have some elements for protection as i mentioned earlier uh, it has this slider element there is a little bit of protection for the ankle and for the heel as well the point of this video is not to talk about these shoes in general and what features they offer but it's to make taller riders like you if you're watching this and your shoe size is 13 or 14 you can check out the store that i found out after a lot of research calling lots of places and finally i decided to go down to the store because as you know as a person who has a larger foot size right that shoes are something that you have to wear and see taking a risk by ordering online and then um, the shoe not fitting is just too much of a hassle. But I made that simpler for you by going down there, confirming the sizes and then making this. Now, there is always a difference between the different shoe sizes, uh, different companies and their shoe sizes, the sizes that they make. And I'm happy to confirm that uh, Exustar and Garnet, they maintain the uh, right size when they mention a particular size so both of these are european 48 so in the us uh, standard it's about 13 and a half so great shoes um, as i mentioned earlier these are my regular wear when i'm going to short sunday rides something like that 
and these are my longer touring related boots as you can see wearing the shoes is fairly simple all you have to do is unbuckle these two buckles that are there pull out the velcro and uh, it's stiff i mean it's a bit difficult to do with one hand but you can see this is the gore-tex lining that's there inside um and they're kind of expensive so they're about thirty thousand. and uh, but the quality of the material used and uh, the fit and finish of the shoe is definitely worth the price and very reliable very comfortable when riding uh, while standing also they're fairly comfortable and they have a huge grip section on this side so just a quick uh, look i want to give you uh, with both the shoes So that uh, covers the little bit of detail that um, I wanted to share about the two shoes that I have purchased. Now if you want to go ahead and procure some riding boots for yourself and you are finding it difficult to find some sites that provide shoes and this is not just for taller riders with larger shoe size, this is for general audience that might be watching what i'm going to do is put a, some links down to some really good sites that i've uh, found through my research that do offer uh, good riding boots at uh, decently competitive prices and you can go ahead and order from them uh, of course all of the details regarding the delivery the pricing so on and so forth you can go ahead and find out from the website itself so yes uh, you can have a look at that and let me know if you have used these links or this video has been useful to you using the comments and as always some if you found that there is a little bit of value that is being provided by this video please go ahead and like the video if you have some taller friends who do also ride and they might be looking out for boots you can possibly share this video with them and as always please stay safe um, we are still not over the second wave yet uh, there is still a lot of shortage in terms of beds icu ventilators oxygen so on and so forth so try to stay at home as much as possible there's a hashtags going on park the ride so on and so forth well we should follow it that's what's important 